Shop till you drop. Exploring local shopping customs around the world. Hello, language explorers. Today we are going to delve into an exciting topic, local shopping customs. We'll be examining how people make purchases in different parts of the world, and of course, we'll learn some useful English vocabulary along the way. Our first stop is negotiation. Negotiation is a common shopping custom in many cultures, especially in markets and small shops. It is like a dance, a game of back and forth until both parties agree on a price. It's essential to remember that politeness and respect are key during negotiations. Phrases like, could you give a better price? Or, is this your final offer? Can be used to negotiate. Next up is tipping. In some countries, like the USA, tipping is customary when receiving services such as dining at a restaurant, getting a haircut, or taking a taxi. A typical tip is around 15 to 20 percent of the total bill. Learning phrases such as, keep the change, which means you allow the service provider to keep the rest of the money as a tip, can come in handy. Bartering is an age-old custom where goods or services are exchanged without using money. It's less common in modern societies but still practiced in some parts of the world. While bartering, the phrase, would you consider a trade, can be useful. Lastly, we'll look at the ways people pay for goods. In some places, cash is king, while in others, most transactions are done digitally or with cards. Understanding phrases like, do you accept credit cards? Or, where is the nearest ATM? Can prove very useful when traveling. And there we have it, a quick tour of the world of local shopping customs. Remember, Understanding these customs and their related vocabulary can help you blend in and have more authentic experiences in different cultures. Keep practicing, and you'll be shopping like a local in no time. Happy language learning, and I'll see you in our next video.